sperm count um, amount of sperm that uh, men produce it could be uh, already preset um, you know some men produce a lot of sperm and some men don't and a lot of them are genetically uh, determined uh, unless uh, man has any uh, medical predisposition that impacts the uh, sperm production. Assuming that there is really no uh, vascular disease, diabetes, or any kind of a bad habit such as you know, smoking or um, uh, heavy drinking type, um, the, the best way to increase the uh, uh, sperm count during the time of insemination is, you know, we emphasize abstinence uh, between two to five days. In other words, no more than five days, but no less than two days. So if the man had no uh, ejaculation uh, for uh, more than five days, sometimes the quality of the sperm may not be as good. Um, also, if there, we need some level of accumulation, so if uh, the man had the intercourse last night, this morning may not be the best time to get the uh, sperm collection. So um, keeping in that zone, uh, two to five days of abstinence will give us the uh, optimum yield in terms of uh, number of sperm and the quality of the sperm.